mention it all. Mention it all. Goodbye, Kyle. Who's calling who a frog? Love you, baby. Bye. Hello, Burberry Troop. Welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Burberry Hills. And guys, I have some cold, cold iced tea coming from the cold mountains of Salt Lake City for you. And we're going to be talking about Miss Heather Gay and Mary Cosby going after each other. Uh, another example of Mary just being plain disrespectful. And Heather, it's like, I'm done. I'm done with this bitch. Like, I'm not going to do this anymore. And then basically going after each other okay uh but before we get into it do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel do it right now if you are new here and you want to join the bear rate troop subscribe 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 hit the notification bell guys we are on our way to 30k so if you want to join the family you know what to do and let's talk about this mess Oh, it's just like every single time that we're gonna be talking about mary cosby it's all about the disrespect it's all about how she's not able to, like, act normal, you know? Like, she, because she lived on this pedestal, you know? And, like, especially after watching last episode when, like, everyone was, like, rolling around and, and like, you know, singing and speaking in tongues and doing the whole cult thing, you know? That's what she's used to, you know? And that, like, she is used to people... No, it's not even kissing her ass. It's just like literally like, like uh, praying to her, like, you know, uh, loving her to a point of non-existence, like having her into that, like such a high like standard that that's what she's used to. Like she wants every single person around her to be doing the same thing over and over and over, you know? And when she finds people that is not like that, which means basically every single person out there, then that's why she's not going to like it. And my thing is... My thing is that she is just plain disrespectful, okay? Mary Cosby is a rude person. Her personality is like that. And a lot of people try to justify her. Well, like, I mean, the other girls are not nice to her. The other girls this, the other girls that. I'm so sorry. It's just like Mary Cosby doesn't even give the opportunity to be nice to her. Because the moment she's putting a foot into an event, into a party, into a restaurant, she's already making faces. She's already talking to herself. She's already trashing everyone and everything around her, thinking like, oh, this is disgusting. This is horrible. How can they do this? Oh my God, like, I don't like this. I don't do this. I don't blah, blah, blah. How the fuck are people supposed to relate to you? How, supposed, how, how does people supposed to be your friend when you don't even, like, give a chance why? Because she wants everyone to be screaming her name, saying like, Mary, you are my best friend. You are my best friend. I love you. Bitch, that is not going to happen. But like, anyways, now she's with a group of like very eccentric women that, you know, they all have an opinion. They all have a, a voice, you know, and they are going to let her have it. So, Heather K is basically uh, putting her foot down and calling Mary out on all the bad things that she has been calling her for a lot of time. Um, Heather is saying that Mary has slammed her for... I'm, I'm sorry. Heather slammed Mary for her horrible slurs and degrading comments, okay? Uh, listen to this. This is what Heather has to say. Mary has lo lobbied that at me a lot. She says, you look like a man. That's why you don't have a man. And you don't even have a husband. Why are you even here? This is a housewife show and you can't be a wife without a man. And I'm like, well, you fuck your, your step granddaddy. So I'm not quite sure how that all work out. But she feels fine loving those horrible slurs at me. Um, I mean, how can we defend Mary when she goes around? The thing, I, I mean, Mary doesn't think what she says. She just put like, like, you know, 
vomit everything out there. She doesn't really think about other people's feelings. She doesn't because she doesn't give a shit about anyone else. She never. I feel like. I feel that the problem is like she has never had to deal with other people's feelings ever, you know, and she just thinks like she said, like whatever I say, it's facts. So I feel that because of that, she doesn't really know how to relate to people, how to talk to people and how to be respectful to other people. I'm literally thinking that every single time that Mary is saying any of these words, she thinks she's right on her mind. And that's like even the worst part, because how you correct someone like that how you call her out something like that when she is probably thinking well i'm right um of course mary cosby she is responding to all of this she says oh my god this is so typical i don't remember saying that okay and then she's according to mary she only mentioned heather's lack of a husband because heather pointed out that genuine husband had paid for her trip and she wanted to enlighten heather on her wars i was like oh so you don't have one so that means you don't deserve to be here she, um had to be provoked wait what oh she recalled insisting her comment had to be provoking from somewhere It's like she's trying to defend herself, but then she's literally telling us how much of an asshole she is. Oh, you don't have one, so you don't deserve to be here? Bitch, you do, do you even know what real housewife is? Like, this is not a show about housewife. Not everyone needs to be married on this show. It just goes so, like, behind me, honestly. And then... Heather is responding, saying, the fact that I'm here without a husband is credit to me. The fact that I show up at all of these events alone is credit to me. The fact that I fight all of these battles without going home to someone who wants to listen to me, support me, pay my goddamn bills, that is a credit to me. And if you want to weaponize that and use it against me, you are not just degrading me. I'm in a privileged place powerful position you are degrading every single woman and single mother out there that is doing everything they can for their kids and that i and that i won't stand for girl um i'm sorry like i just have to agree with heather on this one you know and you know that i'm not like a super heather lover but i have to agree with this one because it's just like mary's plain rude and mary's like putting all these things out there and and constantly just attacking people for no reason uh the heather says that she stopped talking to mary and said that she doesn't plan to do so until she apologized which let's be honest it's never gonna happen uh, and if Mary's reaction to Heather's step granddaddy shade is any indicator of an apology, won't be coming soon. And then she says, that doesn't bother me. It's my life. It's 23 years ago. We'd be married. Okay, this is Mary. Mary's talking, saying, that doesn't bother me. It's my life. It's 23 years ago. We've been married 24 years. At least I landed someone. We are probably the same age and you're still looking for a husband. Girl, when she can tell me what I did to her, maybe I'll listen to Heather. Other than that, put her on mute. Uh, I'm so sorry. It's just like Mary is undefendable. Like at this point, it's like, who can tell me that any of the words or sentences that come out of, Ma of Mary Cosby are okay? It doesn't make sense, you know? And don't come here telling me that people were attacking Mary Cosby because Mary Cosby has been the one who has always come after these women first. She has been the one who has always, like, act like she's superior and hating on all of these women. I'm just glad that she's gone. Although there are rumors that she might be secretly filming for season three, but I also have been hearing for, um, from a lot of people on a lot of sources on Salt Lake City saying that that's fake and that she's not coming back. So I don't know if she's in denial, if she doesn't know like that she has actually been fired. I have no idea. Anyways, so let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Are you Team Heather on this one or Team Mary Cosby? Let me know and why. And like always, don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, guys. 
and I'll see you in an hour. See ya. Bye.